Hey guys, um, yeah, I know it's been a while since I've posted a video, mostly because of, well, kind of watched the last video, and it kind of explains, I went through a really tough time, um, but luckily for me, as soon as October was over, like, two days after it was over, it started getting better, much, much better, <laughs> but, um, I wanted, to, I wanted to come on and tell you, and show you guys how my collection has pretty much blown up in the past like month I've been I've been having uh some stuff pretty much dropped into my lap in the, the past couple days and I just wanted to show you guys what's been going on uh that and that and some of my collection it, they it, the collection stuff has changed so much that the actual collection pictures are old they're way past old so let's go ahead and get things started I'll show off the transformers first let's get the camera Okay. Okie dokie. And I can't tell if I was in the video or not. Whoopsie. Uh, so I got the Paraglide Side of Scythe with the Classic Hot Rod. Silverbolt. Uh, my Classics have been traded off. Just to show everybody. And. Or well, most of the Classics. And this is pretty. Uh, and trust me, that I, I got really really swindled out of that trade. Uh, I really did. The only thing left is that beachcomber to the hot rod and jazz over there. Got a little mean jazz collection. Got a mini little hot rod collection. Why? Well, because there's a couple of my favorite characters. Now to the headboard. I'll grab this. And a neat little story is that as he comes into frame, I got a first edition bulkhead. And I got him for less than retail. I got him during a Christmas sale. And there it was, he was, what, 25? And then, uh... He was 25. And then they had a 15% off coupon. So I got less than retail for him. So that made me happy. And I also got this big, this big dude right here. Thanks to Demon Wolf, one of my subscribers. I gotta send him some stuff. Um, there's Rodimus. I got myself a G1 Megatron, but it is loose, incomplete, a lot of sticker damage, and uh, two cracked joints in it that he did not tell me about. I felt completely swindled out of that deal. Oh. How'd you get down here? I didn't realize you were down there. Put you back. Got. And you fell down too. What the. Cats, I swear. Got, of course, kickback from from the newest generation line. As you can pretty much tell, the Decepticons dwindled in number very greatly. Oh, why? Well, because a lot of people wanted the Decepticons, and I'm kind of hesitant on getting rid of my Autobots. And the prime shelf has grown. I can't really see the picture, but I can kind of see it. Uh, the prime shelf has grown, Primus has gone, but in the case of that, I've gone to. You can obviously what. One of the things that took his place, uh, NP10 right there, and behind him is. Energon Optimus. I got him as well. Um, and I'm in, going. And I'm actually in the uh, in the works of trying to get a wing saber. Since all the primes up there from the Cybertron line are in their upgraded modes, uh, and for down here, I know this isn't consistent, but I'm going to keep it for one part Transformer fans and one part for Toka fans, since I'm going to try to keep it in the same video. That's pretty much it for Transformers. Um, they've dwindled a little bit, but not really grown, mostly because I've been really, really, really selective on what I buy. Uh. But yeah, uh, I do admit um, they are getting better. They really are. But that's a later for a bit different video. Now for off-topic stuff or topic stuff, depending on where you're watching this video. Uh, I don't know why I pushed all the Gundams to the side and leave this giant gaping hole. I'm gonna spread them out again. Um, there's that, and then this. I got this from a local friend. Uh, I traded my Go Say Great with Seek Brothers. For all of this and ten bucks, 
Yeah. Yeah, I'm just gonna let your jaws drop at that, that fact right there. Everything is there. The sword and shield are there, and plus the little that thing. If anybody's got a bull, uh, a, the bull's or or what is? It? I can't remember. Not Mugu Dayu, I think. I can't remember the Japanese name, but the bull Megazord, the Japanese counterpart. If anybody has it, let me know, because I want to make this giant, cl uh, this giant cluster of Zords. And then two days later, after this kid, not two days later, like a week later, after this kid traded me, he wants to get. He told me he had some spare stuff he wants to get rid of. Including giving back my own Gosei Great. Because he found out he had a spare. How does this 15 year old kid have a spare? I have no idea. Yeah, dead laptop plus new headset. And, and part, and Gundam knows this, but Gundam gave me, or traded me, Pyramidus. And a spare Lion Zord and a spare Frog. That's the old original Frog Zord that's broken. The Ninja Mega Zord now has a new. Frog Zord on it, and SPD Command Base. He's on the floor right now because um, there's only a couple places I can put him, and those places are well took it up by something else. Um, and I'm trying to keep the Toku stuff and the Transformer stuff separate. And along with him, if you guys follow my Twitter, I got him the Gosei Great. Uh, dear God, I cannot remember their names. Uh. The jungle... This one? Geki Fire. I can't remember the Japanese name or the American name at the moment. Those two. That's actually Engine O. All these... All the... All go on... All, uh, I can make G9. Go under G9. Except for... Uh, crap. I'm missing Carry Gator. I just need Carry Gator. Let's see. And Zeo with Battleizers in the back. And the funny part is... They all have their engine souls except for Bear V. I just need the engine soul for Barry. Um, the SPD mega, the was it Delta Max Megazord, the the combination with the motorcycle, and the electronics works. The sword's there and the gun's there. The only problem is that the sword, the hinge for the sword is uh, broken. I need to glue that. But I have the combination. I'm happy. And down here, nothing's really changed down here. Uh, the original Super Zeo, Mystic Titan Megazord, Mini Pla, Go Say Great. The Ninja Megazord, Ninjor, Go Buster Ace. Oh yeah, I got the Astro, uh, the Astro Mega Ship. Uh, which I, well, I'll say something here in a minute. Uh, White Tiger, Thunder Megazord, and Lightspeed Rescue. Now, the White Tiger, Astro Mega Ship, and both those things over there, when I received them, they were in very, very dirty condition. They were dusty, they were dirty, they had stuff spilt and dried on them. Um, but I took advice from MMPR Toys, and I cleaned them up, and they actually looked really good. Uh, just need to polish them up, and they look even better. That polish you can't really find, you gotta order offline. Ugh, okay. Oh yeah, also, for Christmas, oh, new Xbox. I just wanted to show that off really quickly. Uh, Mom completely surprised me with a brand new Xbox with two games inside of it. Oh yeah. Almost forgot about my comrade yourself. Duh. Um, nothing really new here. Uh, O's ta um, SIC Tataba, SIC uh, Tata Door. Duh. And then that is grid mount with the grid armor. But other than that, nothing's really changed. Um, common rider stuff since it's kind of expensive. I've been kind of teetering away, not teetering away, but being very selective on that first. That and for common writers, their main selling point for me is their role play stuff, and that's about it. I mean, I'm digging the SIC, the I'm digging the O's SICs, but I can't really say anything else. Uh, there's no really big item, big ticket item, except for the gimmicks, which I do have a couple rings in my possession because they belong to Demon Wolf, and I do admit I like them. I might pick up a couple rings, but I might. I might just stay away from it altogether, from Wizard, because the gimmicks are getting more and more ridiculous and I'm not really liking it. I'm also trying to remember if I've forgotten anything. Uh, this shelf, yeah, this shelf was, used to be pure, pure Transformers, but now it's like, and uh, just random stuff? And yes, you saw that right, that's My Little Pony stuff, I didn't get it. My friend, uh, my friend James, who helps me with the Pokemon stuff here in Voter. Um, he's a brony. 
And randomly one day he was like, hey, Christmas dude. And I was like, okay. Okay. Free stuff. I'm not really complaining. And that's about, oh yeah, Dead Space 3. Love it. I'm gonna, that's pretty much about it. Go say great. Yeah, you can tell I ran out of stuff for places for the Megazords. Because go say great over there. Shinkano with the, I think it was at the Ikan Tenken Buster. Just for a heads up, I'm horrible with names. Or at least, especially Japanese names. English names? Oh, I can remember them. I can't remember this name. It was the Claw Samurai Megazord. I'm, I'm horrible. Again, I, overall, I guess overall, I'm just horrible with names. But, uh, that's it for the collection. Now, for needs and wants out of this, um, I need six, uh, Engine 6 Karigata from Goanger. Um, before anybody sends me replies for the accessory mix for the Geki Rangers, if I get them as, like, part of a package deal, yay. But if. Uh, but if I don't get them, I'm not, I'm not hurting. And yes, both of the electronics gimmicks works, and the only thing that was wrong was that this one was missing two of its tails. But again, not the I'm really complaining about. Oh yeah, the samurai sword's now hanging up. <coughs> uh, what else do I need? Oh, and I'm still looking for a SWAT Megazord. I'm trying to get one. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, the... The SPD stuff was included, and he gave me a really, really great deal. I was in talks of getting another one, but that one was missing his accessories, all of its accessories, and the electronics didn't work. And that dude was, the dude, uh, the kid that I got those from was offering that, all of that for the same exact price that the other guy was offering me. So I was like, yeah, I'm going to have to turn this guy down. But yeah. Um, looking to get my classics back since there's a dude who's uh, offering a really great price for all of them. Yeah. Dead Space 3! 10 in the Midnight Launch got that. That was awesome. Yeah, giant boxes of crap. Mostly due to... Mostly due to... That's where I got all the... That's how I transported the Megazords home because I got them at work. Uh, Yeah, I got a job now. Yay! Um, yeah, if you listen to the podcast. But anyway, I'm going to end this video. <clears throat> Boom. I'm going to end the video on this, pretty much, uh, saying I am coming back. Just the holidays and all the emotions. And losing my camera for a couple of months, too. I just found it yesterday. Uh, the I was an emotional wreck. The I it was either I was at work, shelled off, or I was here, shelled off. But I am coming back, and I reached 40 subscribers out of nowhere, which shocks me a little. Oh, uh, last time I checked, I had 26. Where did the other 14 come from? But anyway, guys, take care, and I'll see you guys later.